this machine might be the best jumper on Earth. It's 30 centimetres high, but can leap more than 30 metres into the air, three times the current world record for a jumping robot. And it does it using unnatural engineering. Many robots use designs based in biology. The best jumpers the animal kingdom has to offer have a plethora of ways to maximise their leaps, like long limbs, strong muscles and extended joints. Some insects, like grasshoppers, even use a form of power amplification to exceed the limitations of their muscles, stretching specialised elastic rods in their exoskeletons that launch them when released. But as diverse as the natural world is, evolution hasn't cracked every option, and there is something that machines can do that nature can't. Work multiplication. Even the most powerful muscles only offer a single stroke of action, Meanwhile, machines can use mechanisms like ratcheting or rotating to build up a store of energy before releasing. Now a team of researchers have investigated the differences between engineered and biological jumpers and took those insights to create a device capable of jumping 32.9 metres. That's taller than the statue of Christ the Redeemer in Brazil. The jumper uses a small motor to reel in a polyethylene line compressing springs made of an advanced hybrid material. Then a lightweight release mechanism unlatches to launch the device skywards. Simple, but each element has been finely tuned and honed to maximise jumping performance. From lightweight feet designed to better transmit energy at launch, to a shape that morphs into an aerodynamic dart. According to the team behind the jumper, this design might be near the mathematical limit of jump height using available materials. And this isn't just an exercise in cool robot design. Jumping is potentially a useful mode of transportation, especially in situations where flight is impossible. For instance, if there's no atmosphere. Indeed, jumping mechanisms have already been used in space. In 2018, the JAXA Hayabusa 2 mission landed two different hopping rovers on the asteroid Ryugu. Their jumping prowess allowed them to manoeuvre around the rocky environment with less risk of getting stuck than would face a wheeled rover. The designers of this device estimate that on the surface of the moon, it could leap an astonishing 125 metres high and travel half a kilometre in a single bound. So perhaps the next giant leap in space exploration will be taken by a mechanical jumper like this one.